Hello everyone, this is Voltaire42, back from hibernation. Wait, is it... Did I go to sleep? Ow! Okay. You're going down, Skelly. You're going down. Yes! Yes! Oh yeah, bone. Ah! Ah! He got me in my gut! Oh, and my foot. Dang it. I got an arrow to the knee. Okay. Yeah! Okay. Uh, yeah, okay. So I did this because I thought that'd be interesting little... I have to match it on the other side too, so I'm gonna do that. Yeah, I like that. Very, very good. Very, very good. Oh. Burn. There we go. I have any. Okay. Okay, so we are back with Voltaire 42 and we are going to talk about another thing from my list of things to talk about. <sighs> okay, so next weekend, uh, my wife's brother is actually coming into town. Um, it's, uh, it's been planning it for a little while now. Um, He's been out in California for a while, and, you know, coming in, all, all good things, come to those who wait, that kind of stuff. He's going to be hanging out, and uh, I believe he's actually going to be staying at our place for a little while. Um, hmm. Actually, I just thought about something. Uh, but, yeah, so he, he's coming to stay for a little bit. But there's this interesting thing where, um, so my house has been conscripted. Uh, for those of you that don't know what that means, um, conscripted is uh, sort of like a military military esque term where it basically means we're being drafted or uh, we're being brought into it against our will almost. Well, it's against my will. Let me put it that way. Uh, my wife is absolutely fine with doing it, but uh, every now and then, uh, well, the last time we had this family gathering, I am out of spruce. I am out of spruce. Dang it. You, come here. Uh, yeah, I'm out of spruce. I, I kind of like this. I don't know how I'm going to, I guess i got to reach it this way. Uh, and then that. I'll bring it in a little bit. I gotta try it in and I'll try it out since I got two sides here. I'll see which one I like best. Okay, yeah, but um, yeah. Uh, so the last time we had a party, uh, like a whole family get together type of thing, uh, we were conscripted as well then. And basically what happened was uh, my fam, our families were. Like, oh, yeah, no, uh, I think it was like a 4th of July or something. They're like, you know, oh, yeah, we're going to have a party. You know, we don't really have a location. Do you mind if we do it at your house? Or like, uh, and I'm like, of course, because it's me, I'm kind of like, I like, kind of mind. And, uh, but they're like, oh, don't worry about it. We'll, we'll come. We'll bring all the food. You don't have to worry about anything. Just clean. Just make sure the house is clean. And, you know, we'll do everything. I'm like, ah, 
And I was like, okay. In the end, I was just like, yeah, sure, why not? And, I mean, they're going to do everything. I might as well just, you know, play along type of stuff. And so, we had a... We had a party. And, I mean, it wasn't bad, but at the same time, it's not something I... I love doing, so, you know, it, but, uh, yeah, we, we've been sort of conscripted again, they're, they're like, yeah, we're gonna, you know, uh, Sarah's, uh, my lovely wife's brother's coming out, she's like, hey, yeah, let's, uh, let's have that, uh, let's have, let's have a party, you know, since he's in town, it's like, okay, you know, let's go to the party, and it's like, oh, it's gonna be at your place, and it's like, oh, great. Like, I'm, I don't know. It's one of those things where it's like, I'm fine with having a party at my place if I'm the one that offered to do it, but I'm not the one that offered to do it. I've, I've been the option, it was not my option to say yes or no. It wasn't, it also wasn't like my option, someone didn't say, hey, you know, we're thinking of having a party, you know. Do you mind if we have it over your place? It, it was. It's more of a, hey, we're going to have a party. It's going to be at your place. Hope that's okay. It. That's what sort of gets me. Like, not asking people. Like, not just assuming everything is going to be okay. Like, uh, one of the reasons why... Um, I love one of my friends is, uh, you know, like, we will, we'll order food, uh, at, at lunch at work, and, you know, we, uh, you know, some days I'll pick up the tab, some days he'll pick up the tab, and, you know, we don't worry about, you know, oh, you know, I always order less, you order less, or, like, you know, if he gets something, he's like, oh, man, this is really good, and I'm like, Hey, mind if I have some? He's like, yeah, sure. He'll give me half. He doesn't mind because he knows that, you know, I'm not... Mm, yeah. He, he knows because I'm not doing it to, like, get ahead. I'm honestly just, you know, want to taste some of the food. Like, he'll... And he's... And I know that he's just, you know, happy to give me some. At the same time, like, uh, there's this one place uh, near where we work. It's called Chicken, um, it's called Super Chicken. And it's a great place. It makes this amazing chicken. And it always tastes good. Uh, but we, uh, we're adventurous eaters. And so there's this, like, this cow soup. Not cow soup. It, yeah, I guess it's sort of like a cow soup. And... So we will, we'll, we love having it, but what happens is, uh, we'll go there, and he'll order the cow soup, and I'll order, uh, like we get, you get two sides, so he'll order one side in the cow soup, and I'll order two other sides, and then we'll split each of, uh, the sides down the middle, and we'll get, like, you know, this larger variety of different stuff. And, you know, like, we know that we're not, like, it's, like, we don't, we never have the problem of, like, someone being like, one of us being like, hey, I think you got more, because we don't care if the other person got more, because the other person, it's not like they're doing it intentionally. And, I mean, it, I, I figure that's a good way to show, you know, a, a good friendship is, you know, you're not trying to get something from the other person that they normally wouldn't give you. Mm. I'm gonna do a little bit of altering of the terrain. Bam. 
Yeah, it's good. It's good. Okay, I like it. Mm, this could be moved back a little bit more, but that's fine. Oh, that's right, there used to be like a small hill here that you were able to go up on that. <laughs> Actually, that means I might, I might want to just like shave this off a little bit more, make it a little bit more even. Make it so I can sort of go right up here to here a little bit more easily. Carrots grow. I need another. F I need a field of carrots. My field of wheat is coming along very nicely. You know, it's scary. If I were to harvest this entire field, plant all of it back, and then plant all of the seeds extra that I get from it, I could probably fill in this area right around here. And this whole area would be it. I mean, you guys have seen me start from just that little tiny farm right there to now this whole amount of farm in what i think this is the 30 sorry no i think this is the 40th episode yeah this is episode 40 and i've gone from you know just one or two small things to i could i could drown the world in wheat at this point. Very nice, very, very nice. I like it. Okay. That is a step down. I may not do that. We'll have to figure out what I'm going to do with that side later, actually. Um, oof. I have no idea what I'm going to do with that. Huh. Interesting. Interehante. Oh, wait, now I have one. Dive, dive, dive. And there we go. I like this. I really do. So, yeah. Um, let's see. Don't show I'm being conscripted. Uh, you know, it's extremely cold right now. It, I don't know why. It's just so cold. It's just so very, very cold. Uh, uh, I wish it wasn't so cold. So let's see, so this goes under here, like this, yeah, so I can, this is great, this is absolutely perfect. I have an idea for that, it's going to be interesting to see how that works. If that works. Oh 
Okay. Uh, I need... I've already got a bunch. Bam, 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 bam. Wham, bam. Thank you, Spruce Fence. That's not bad. It's not great either. Okay, now let's go with outside. 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 It, I think it widens it a little bit. Uh, yeah, I thought so. Yeah, it definitely feels like it widens it. And this, it feels like it's sort of a little bit narrower, a little bit more homey. And because I'm the only one on the world, I I want things to f sort of, well, sometimes feeling grandiose, I want it to be a little more quaint sometimes, and I think that, that goes well with this. Oh, I'm really messing up. Okay. what I'm going to do with these. Very nice, very, very, very nice. I like it. Um, actually, I wonder. Uh, whoop. one more thing and that'll give me a good idea about which one I want to do. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna switch all these out. Which sucks, it means I've just made a ton of these uh, spruce ones that I'm not gonna use.
Sorry, I'm getting a little uh, quiet again, aren't I? Okay, uh... Yeah, man, it is cold outside. Actually, it's making me start thinking of, uh, like, Christmas and all that. Uh, boop. Yeah. Actually, that reminds me. I gotta start, um... Getting together my list. Actually, this is a good little hint and tidbit. For those of you that are... In computer inclined, a great way to do a Christmas list is to use a Google Doc. I'm not even joking. I've I've done this for like two years now, and it's great because you can be like, okay, everyone, here is my Google Doc with all of the things that I want for Christmas. You can organize it however you want, and just email it to people. It'll email the list and everyone can go and check it. And I mean, as long as you're like, okay, listen, uh, you know, make sure that you, know, you contact, you know, people say, you know, hey, have you gotten this thing? Or, you know, have you, uh, you know, it, it gets a little hairy if you've got like, you know, 20 different people asking for your list. Yeah, but at the same time, it's not that hard. Um, actually, whoa. I just looked at the clock. I got, I'm in the 22nd minute. I will, um, I guess we'll call this, uh, an episode. So, hey, everyone, remember, like, subscribe, and comment. Always appreciate the feedback. And I will see you guys in the next episode. Bye.